The control project in the South Bay tonight could save hundreds of homes from destruction, but by the time it is done, it might be too late. Night Beats Maria Medina joins us live in Milpitas, where homeowners have been stuck in some red tape, right, Maria? That's right, Veronica. And this is the flood project behind me. It's supposed to save all these homes around me. And this area floods every 10 to 20 years. It's overdue for a flood. And now the county is saying the state is threatening the project. You, you cannot take the risk and gamble on people's lives. And it's Santa Clara Valley Water District Vice Chair Richard Santos says time could be running out. And we're trying to get this thing completed, and this delay may cause. A flood. His agency just filed a lawsuit against state leaders, claiming they're getting in the way of a major flood project in Milpitas. They uh, reneged on the agreement. They wanted to put more restrictions. The lawsuit claims the San Francisco Bay Regional Water Quality Control Board gave the green light to widen the channel of the Upper Berryessa Creek last year. But then a couple months ago, the board changed their minds, demanding 15,000 feet of creek be restored somewhere in the South Bay, which Santos says will cost millions more dollars and cause delays. When they revoked those permits. We have to start all over again. A bureaucratic mess, red tape. What the heck? Come on, seriously. Cindy Toy lives nearby and says if the project isn't finished next year like expected, it could be devastating for the area. Because they don't get it completed, then we will get a flood. Because as you can tell, they dug up or filled up our creek. I understand how people feel. I've been there. Santos says he's not only speaking for the water district after learning lessons from the destructive Coyote Creek flood earlier this year, he's also speaking as someone who's lived through three floods in El Viso. Lost everything I owned as a child and as an adult three times. And you never forget it. Let's get this done so we can make sure that uh, everybody here is protected. And what's more, this project is supposed to reduce the risk of flooding at the first BART station that's supposed to be built here in the county at the end of this year. The Regional Water Board did not return my call.